So to continue with the structures of the bone, we'll look at the spongy. We did the compact. Now we'll do the, the central area. So uh, this is where the spongy bone would be found. Can I borrow that live bone here? Okay. So if you look at this, okay, we're looking at what's here in the center now, where the spongy bone would be. Here's the compact, which is this compact. And this is where the spongy would be. Spongy is made up of a structure, bony structure known as a trabeculum. So each one of these pieces is a trabeculum. Many trabeculae interwoven make up the spongy bone. So the spongy bone is all of these trabeculae interconnected to one another. The trabeculae are covered in another connective tissue called the endosteum. So inside the bone, endosteum, covering the trabeculae. Inside the central canal, lined with endosteum. Outside the bone, periosteum. The space is called the marrow cavity. And the marrow cavity is where you're gonna find red marrow, which are cells that produce red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets. Or, for some bones, yellow marrow which is simply adipose tissue that just kind of fills the space of the bone.